some skin cloaks are very important uh, cultural item in our communities. The project that we're doing now with um, the Peter Mackin Breast Cancer Network Australia and, and the amazing women that have come together with, with the intention in their hearts and spirits. It's a really big act of generosity because these are women who are survivors of cancer. Um, in particular, some of them breast cancer and some of them are still in treatment and they've come to make a cloak of healing to be used for other patients, people who are experiencing cancer, living with cancer and their families. And they'll be able to use it here at Peter Mac uh, when they come in, so it's pretty awesome. You know, when you feel isolated in a room, in a sterile environment, to have something that has been gifted for you to, to feel comfort is beautiful. Yeah, so I, I think it's a lovely gift from Victorian Aboriginal women to the community. Culture is connected to well-being. If you have the revival of culture, health outcomes improve, we know that today and in the future making these skins, possum skin cloaks, is wonderful. It goes back to a long time ago where we would sit around in circles and and share our stories and, and yarn while we're doing things. That's what connects us, our relationships with each other. Not just making a cloak, but it's also the process of making the cloak. So being here at Peter Mac, we will be sewing our stories into the cloak. That in itself is, is a healing process too. Being here with the women and, um, you know, doing the possum skin cloak, I just love it. I think, I think it's absolutely amazing that I've had the opportunity to sit in this circle with these amazing women, all diagnosed with breast cancer, so we all know each of, one of us has been through a bit of a journey. And I feel privileged and proud to be part of this amazing opportunity today. When I put the cloak on the other day, I just felt so warm and it just meant, you know, such a lot to me. You feel safe. I'm wrapped in one now and it's just, it's just an amazing, amazing feeling and, and I think every hospital should actually have one. I think it can be a powerful weapon as part of your healing, not just the chemotherapy, not just the radiation therapy, but also how strong you are in your beliefs and culture. So to have access to to country, to your cultural beliefs is so important for your spiritual well-being. To the ancestors and to our women and men that come into this hospital for a blessing for this hope. The reclaiming of that cultural activity uh, will help a lot of Aboriginal people. That's passing on to our younger generation. You know, my great-great-great-granddaughter will hopefully make her own cloak.